Hey YouTube, this is Lonzo Perry 36 and today I've got the very long anticipated LEGO Custom Mad Hatter minifigure that I was going to show you a while ago, as, yeah, but I finally have found all the parts and I'm ready to show you right now. So let me show you how to make my Custom Mad Hatter minifigure. Okay guys, welcome to the close up of making my Custom LEGO Mad Hatter minifigure. Um, this is really awesome, this minifigure, um, it's very fun to make, and so let's get started, you'll only need four minifigs. Uh, let's start off with the ghost, he, um, I'm going to use his hands today, so he's just, so he's the white hands, and that is it. And you can use another minifig if you want, just for the white hands, so just get any other minifig with white hands. Um, next I have this construction worker. I think I got this in the set um, 7630, a construct construction set in Lego City. I think it was 2006. Um, anyway, I need his legs. Um, I think this is it, the box. I'll get a review on that one later on. Yeah. Um, so you got those pieces there. Go up to the next one. Here we have is Marcus Flint or Marcus Flint, Marcus Flint um, from the Quidditch match, uh, 2010, I believe. And you will be needing his. Hang on, his head, just his little head. <laughs> um, next you will need the leprechaun. Ha ha ha. A little bit Irish. Anyway, um, and you will need to take most of him apart. I got this in the Lego Mini Fig series. Uh, I think it was series four or five, maybe six. I'm not sure. Um, so take his hat off. That is what you'll need. You mostly need this um, green hat. Uh, and take his torso off as well. And you'll be left with his torso and his hat. So now what you have to do, you just move these up a little bit, is you've got to take the hands off, the yellow hands off the torso and add the white ones on. Pretty cool. I was planning to use the yellow ones but they didn't look that good after all. So like that. Then get your orange legs and stick them on the body. And then the head. Very cool. Um, and then the hat. There you go. But he's not quite done yet. So, let me just um, show you the last step you have to do. And let me just get this to focus up. Okay. So, um, next bit you'll need to do is get this uh, sticky paper. Uh, peppermint, I think it's called. Um, let me just show you. There you go. And so just get this paper. And so it's like a sticky paper, um, so you can stick on stuff, and so on. And what you have to do is cut out a little part, which says 10 over 6, and just cut it out. And I really apologise for the lighting today. It is going crazy for some reason. And here it is. And just cut that out, and yeah, you'll be fine. So I now have taken off the sticky bit out of the um, off the paper, and I'm going to stick it on his head right now. So I'll focus up on that, and I'll stick it on him. There we go. I might move it in a little bit closer later on. No, I do it now. Uh -huh. Um, 
yeah. So there you go, guys. All done. And give him a Tommy gun or a little pistol or his little controller pad, if you like. And voila. Very cool. And there you have it. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy it. And I'll see you next time.